the morning. Just finished up uh, about 4.2 miles. Monday's day. That's the long run. I don't know if you can hear it, but the wind is kicking. We are officially trying to, to like grind it through months of Chicago running. So, you know, yesterday, rainy, a little bit of snow, like 34 degrees, just wind like 17 miles per hour. Uh, and then you wake up this morning and what do we got? We got true temperatures of like 30. I think the wind chill 17. I took a screenshot of weather. I'm trying to toss it up um, like over here, over here, or wherever. Uh, and the wind was like 27-ish miles an hour. So yeah, let's get through it. We'll talk a little bit more about it inside. We'll see, um, see you in a bit. Hey all what's up? Uh, we are just ducking out of work a little early today because whew, having one of those issues that's just really common to runners, toenail is detaching. And it's not typically that big of a deal. They come off, they regrow, they take time, and it normally comes back just fine. But I um, just wanted to go, because it's a big toe, wanted to have it checked out real quick. And so there's a place actually over kind of by the train station that I'm gonna go to. Um, and have that checked out, so... Take this off while we're talking. So, yeah, uh, just leaving here. It's windy. I don't know if you could see what I was coming out of, but anyway. Um, so, just the easy port. Sorry. Anyways, the uh, easy report or the quick report is um, even though the nail with the wind is taking my breath away, even though the nail is starting to detach. Um, they recommended against pulling it all the way off right now. However, they did say that it looked like kind of the side of the nails, um, like the bed, maybe a little infected. So going home with some antibiotics, I'll take that twice a day for 10 days to clear it up and then hopefully just get it growing back. Um, nice thing about this place is it's really pretty close to the train station that I take. So a uh, quick walk, which is nice because it is, like I said, very cold. Um, and then hop on the train and head back home. We'll talk more once we get back home about today's run, about how the week looks, so on and so forth, and about the weather. Man, this morning the wind was crazy. Tomorrow we're supposed to have uh, temps in the teens and uh, wind chill in the single digits. So it is that time of year. Anyways, we'll see you later. what's going on Andy here and we are finally back home today so as you can see there was um, a solo run today it was a little over four miles we also went back out with the wife we'll toss some footage up of that uh, after this part of the video went to work which is downtown Chicago showed you some of that and we went to the urgent care because as I mentioned earlier 
pretty common thing for runners, at least from what I understand, but it's the first time it's happened for me. We have, uh, sorry if this is kind of a little gross for some people, I know I don't really love always the medical things, but anyway, uh, like a toenail issue, and so, you know, even though I, I intellectually know that it's a pretty common thing and, and they repair themselves and they just take time and all that sort of stuff, I still wanted to just go have it looked at real quick. There's a couple things that I just wanted some confirmation on that everything was cool. Um, you know, the other thing to kind of talk about is the weather. We are finally, I shouldn't say finally, it makes it sound like I'm, ex like I'm you know, wanting it to come, but <laughs> nonetheless, we are in Chicago winter. So, like I said, you know, yesterday was um, windy, and then today just decided to take that to another level. There was like gale force warnings out over the lake, which is also includes downtown. Uh, the wind was like 20, what did I say, 27 degrees, something like that. I don't know where... I don't know where I put my phone. I took a screenshot of, I'll, put, I'll toss it up, one of these sides, um, of what the weather was this morning. And tomorrow's just going to be even colder. It's going to be like probably 13, 15 degrees, 15 degrees and single digits wind chill. So we're just kind of at that point in the year where um, you just kind of got to gut it out and get the miles in, even though it's not always the most pleasant thing. But... I would still, generally speaking, rather get the miles in than not, and I do enjoy doing it outside, even when it's really pretty cold, more than I do inside on a treadmill. So, um, yeah, I mean, that's kind of where we're at. This is a pretty short recap. Uh, thanks for watching. If you like the video, subscribe, leave a comment down below, smash that like button, ring the notification bell, and I'll talk to you later.